Gee, I wonder who sponsors this car. Hey guys, and welcome to the channel. So here it is, my finished Tamiya M05 TT NSU NSU TT Jägermeister front wheel drive car. So I got it done just in time for Tamiya Tuesday. And really the hardest part for me was just getting all the stickers on. There was just a ton of stickers that had to go on this thing. But I cut everyone out put every sticker on, and I think it came out pretty good. I'm overall very happy with the way it looks. And it was actually a pretty fun car to build, even though I had a little frustration with the manual. I still think it was a pretty fun car to build. On the outside, you can see all the detail. The stickers really do enhance the way the car looks. And the body posts do need to be cut down, but I just didn't do it yet. Not really too worried about it. It actually makes the body a little easier to get on. Searching on the internet, the orange looked a little darker than the orange that is on the VS410. So this ended up being around two, uh, no, three coats of orange and the black, two coats of black. I went with a uh, Tamiya orange and I used uh, black for the bottom skirts. On the inside of the body, I used black just to do a nice coat on the inside. And it also makes the orange look a little darker. This is a front wheel drive car. So the motor is actually located up front. It's a brushed motor and the ESC was included. Uh, the ESC is capable of doing brushless and brushed, but for right now I just have a brushed motor in here. I really don't think I'm going to change it to be honest. I'm using a Traxxas TQI receiver to control everything, and I have a Traxxas 2075 steering servo. The steering on this is pretty interesting. The servo sits in the rear, and there's basically this long arm that hooks up to... I guess you would consider it a bell crank. So the 2075 is strong enough. The tires are pretty small. Yeah, it's not really the best servo for this. I think uh, I almost want to put something a little bit more powerful in there, but either way, it does work. It's a lot of fun to drive. The battery sits down below, just kind of hangs out down there. Keeps a nice low center of gravity. Not that the car sits up that high anyway. And the suspension is just springs. There's no oil or anything in there. It's okay for what it is. Seems to work okay. If you pick one of these kits up yourself and you want to uh, build it, make sure you follow along on the right directions. The M05L, that is what you would be building for the Jägermeister. If you start building the wrong thing, it's not going to work. I know I messed up when I was building this. I started going on the wrong directions, but I got uh, corrected. M05L, everything went together pretty good. And overall, this was a pretty fun kit to put together. All right, guys, so that's about it for today. If you liked what you saw, please click that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. Have a great day, and I'll see you all soon. Bye for now.